Hi and welcome to Atik Rahman YouTube channel and thank you for watching my videos. In this video, I will let you know how you can make create your, uh, create an account in uh, Profit Books and then you can use it for free. This video is very important also. For example, for newbies, they don't know so they can see how to create an account through this video. So let's start. Uh, first, you can see here there is a user login and advisor login. And then for if for example if you already create an account so you should have a username and password and then you have to uh, enter the detail both of them and then you have to click on I am not a robot and then sign in so you can go and use it the profit book but if you don't have an account then you have to create an account first and then you can use this software so we will go and uh, start with the create an account meanwhile I will tell you that uh, if you like my video so please click the like button subscribe my channel press the bell icon and share this video with your friends so they will see and they will get the benefit from my uh, videos as well thank you so now we will move on the this page you can see that there is a startup and smb small and medium businesses so for free is startup so it's forever free in my last video i already explained uh, what are the benefit you can do that that here is i mentioned create up to 15 vices per month so it's fine so we will go for this uh, sign up for free um, we will see that what are the requirements they uh, required create account link i will keep in the description so you can take it from there as well so now you can see here in get started with profit book the first thing which you need to mention here your company name for example if you, do, you don't have a company and uh, you are a newbie and you want to do practice so you can put the dummy name as well okay so it's not a big deal for example i will do the same dummy name um, so second one for example i will put abc services always i'm using the same name when you fill the form so you have to uh, use your current email id which you're using when we submit this form so we will receive the password on the same email id so it's very important that your email id is valid and uh, you can easily log in and you can uh, get the password uh, through your email id okay so i already mentioned my email id you can uh, give here contact number and then select the country whichever you have and uh, i'm not a robot create your free account they have mentioned now you, now you can check your inbox we have sent you a web welcome email with your login and password detail now that's why i'm saying that it's very important you should have a active email id and the correct email id where you can easily open and see the login and password detail if you don't for example you have an issue so you can contact uh, uh, them through support at profitbook.net if you need any help for example and they have a contact detail as well number as well so i'll go my email id so i will check there so now we will uh, start with the login when you receive the password on your email id so you have to take the password from email id and then uh, you have to enter the login detail i will show you how to do the login you have to add your email id here which you already mentioned at the time of uh, create an account and then the next step is to put the password so the password you have to take from the your email id copy and paste it there and then click on uh, i'm not a robot and then sign in when you do the sign in here is the form in this form you will see that there is a three steps first is user information second one is company information third is account management so we will proceed from one by one and uh, first we have to mention uh, first name then second name or last name you can say that there is no second name so you have to mention your last name and uh, company name is already there state you can select for the which country you are belong to and uh, which state you are belong to you can mention you, you have to give the details so accordingly they will adjust so i already select uh, ue and uh, city um, so city is also same i will mention here for example dubai and number is already there 
get started now the second step is uh, financial year which financial year you are like you have in your company so you have to mention the financial year start on and company started in when the company was started and uh, number of employees industry what do you sell either you have a product or services who manage your accounts so now we will start from for example we our, uh, our year is going to start from uh, financial year is start from january 1st january to december and uh, company started from the same like time 1st january 2022 number of employees we have right now for example 1 to 5 and uh, company we will uh, put uh, anything like for example here any other services other we can put other industry and what do you sell we are giving the services for example who manage your account i have an accountant or what are the other option i have an accountant i am looking for an accountant i do it my myself so you can choose anything um, so i will choose i have an accountant the next step is what the third step account management what problem you are trying to solve with profit book I will mention here manage my business in a proper way you can mention anything it's not an compulsory like you have to mention any specific thing but whatever you want you can mention so now i've select this one option so now it will take me to the dashboard and we will see there uh, what are the detail uh, we can see in the dashboard now you can see the dashboard this dashboard look very nice and um, the c like you have a income and expenses overview item and then you can see the detail for the this month last six month financial year the same thing you can see top 5 unpaid invoices invoices by status top 5 payable so at least an item list also you can see here if you have a item and uh, a new sign up for abc services with the thing so and on the left side you have a different thing for example income expenses banking accounts item report and from here also you can see here for example invoice expenses receipt purchase purchase order of product customer so here you can uh, see the dashboard i hope this video you like it in the next video i will explain uh, step by step how you can uh, make your chart of account and then how you prepare your invoice how you make a receipt so this all the video uh, inshallah i will make um, in coming few days so hope you like my today's video if you like my video please share with your friends like my channel subscribe my channel press the bell icon and keep subscribing and giving me motivation to make more video thank you bye bye